Kia ora and welcome to another electric vehicle charger forecast for New Zealand, brought to you by Ecotricity, New Zealand's only 100% carbon zero certified renewable electricity provider, and ChargeNet, New Zealand's largest electric vehicle charging network. And what a strong summer it's been for electric vehicles, with around 300 rapid chargers now installed, as well as 13 Tesla supercharger stations, and thousands more regular chargers in homes and businesses around the country. In fact, with 36,000 electric vehicles now on the nation's roads and growing fast, the writing's on the wall for petrol and diesel vehicles. So what can we expect over the coming season? Well, let's start with Tesla's charging network, which now has a total of 13 supercharger stations right across the country, charging Tesla cars quickly and all running on Ecotricity's 100% renewable power. And this year, more superchargers are penciled in for construction. Will this finally be the year New Plymouth gets its own supercharger? Negotiations are ongoing and Tesla's coming soon page looks full of promise. So watch this space. Tauranga Tesla drivers are also hoping to get their own supercharger, giving residents there the ability to drive all over the country in true Tauranga style, 30 k's an hour below the speed limit with the left turn indicator stuck on. But that's only Tesla's high speed superchargers. When you look at the great number of Tesla's destination chargers available, the New Zealand summer road trip in a Tesla looks easier than ever. And it's not only Tesla drivers that are enjoying rapid charging. The ChargeNet network is open to all models of electric vehicle and this network continues to roll through New Zealand at lightning pace. In the last year alone, ChargeNet wired up another 19 rapid charging locations around the country, putting the number of these fast charging systems to more than 250 sites. And that number doesn't even include the many destination chargers available nationwide. Now there's another storm brewing for internal combustion engines too, which until now had the advantage of range and refueling time. It's big and it is here. ChargeNet has been busy installing these beasts, which are hyper rapid chargers, capable of delivering 300 kilowatts each. Which means that with the newest generation of electric vehicles like this one, you can pour hundreds of kilometers of range back into the battery in less time than it takes to refuel a combustion vehicle and grab a bathroom break, something I'll be demonstrating soon in an upcoming video. The, the refueling part, not the bathroom break part obviously, so be sure to press the subscribe button. Not only that, with ChargeNet, powered by Ecotricity, you can be driving on 100% carbon neutral energy. And as EV drivers know, it's also much cheaper than gas. So driving electric is now a bit of a no-brainer. If by this stage you're thinking about leaving the dark side and going electric, but you don't really know where to start, be sure to check out the EV Buyer's Guide at ecotricity.co.nz. Or just click the link below this video where you can find all the ranges and prices of every single model of electric vehicle in New Zealand today, allowing you to find something in your or your company's budget to finally ditch buying petrol and diesel. Both the planet and your wallet will thank you. As for the rollout of these fast, hyper rapid chargers, Kaiwaka has just gone live with two of these units, making it Northland's first hyper rapid charging location. This joins the same hyper rapid chargers in Bombay, south of Auckland, and in Taupo as well. And it gets better. Worry no more about arriving to a hyper rapid charger to find it in use because these 300 kilowatt chargers can each charge up to three vehicles at once, two vehicles with CCS plugs and one with Chadamo. As for the charging forecast for more hyper rapid units, over the next 18 months, no fewer than 18 of these powerful chargers will be constructed along major driving routes from Northland to Otago and everywhere in between. I mentioned Kaiwaka, but there are also hyper rapid chargers coming for Auckland's North Shore, Waikato, Tauranga, Rotorua, Bulls, Wellington, Christchurch, Queenstown and Dunedin. But with the number of electric cars growing worldwide and set to accelerate quickly in the next five years, some die-hard gas burners are getting scared. In the USA recently, a group of pickup truck drivers took it upon themselves to get together and block electric car chargers just to prove well, I've got no idea what they're trying to prove. Conversely, in Croatia, dozens of electric cars blocked a gas station to similarly prove 
again, I don't know what they're proving. And even though the organizer said it only lasted six minutes and each EV driver went inside and bought something from the gas station, it does bring up an important point, charging etiquette. Now, while us Kiwis are generally pretty awesome to each other, in the summer heat and with road trip traffic getting the better of us, we can sometimes catch ourselves acting a bit like, well, like Americans. So as we hit the roads this summer, charging etiquette is now more important than ever. Fortunately, the Better NZ Trust has put out this handy infographic teaching us all how to be Kiwis. Because let's face it, this is a pretty awesome place to be. And to wrap up today's Charger forecast, a little bit of gloomy news for the nation's petrofuel suppliers who are feeling the pinch with the world's high oil prices, causing more Kiwis to choose to walk, take public transport, or drive pure electric cars for a fraction of the cost per mile. The result is that a number of petrol stations are being sold off or repurposed as they're looking more and more unprofitable. And they're not alone. In electric car loving Norway, the situation has become so severe that many gas stations are simply ripping out their pumps and replacing them with charging stations because so many motorists are making the change to electric, something which is beginning to happen here too. But petrol stations aren't shying away from the challenge of going electric. ChargeNet's new hyper-rapid chargers in Kaiwaka, for example, are at Gull, while Z Energy and BP are also putting in chargers. So as you venture into the streets this season, drive safely, and if you happen to have been born with a pair of lungs or perhaps care about the future of Kiwi kids, make sure your car uses the good stuff, meaning electricity sourced purely from 100% wind, hydro, and solar power, such as that from Ecotricity proudly part owned by a team of 5 million Kiwis. And they're not just talking the talk. Almost every single charger mentioned in this forecast uses their completely clean electricity. So drive safe everyone, see you later.